yeah, it, uh, it's been very surreal, uh, particularly today, obviously. Uh, Her Majesty was gracious enough to uh, extend an invitation uh, to the palace, so I, uh, I felt very privileged, um, and it was uh, something that I'll obviously remember for a long time. We'd been, it was about a 10 hour uh, gunfight and we'd, uh, our blokes had been pinned down for a number of hours and we'd moved, my patrol commander decided to, uh, to move around and try and flank an enemy position in the green belt in a series of compounds. Uh, the position we thought held a, mach a machine gun, uh, as it turned out, um, about 80 metres away from the position we got hit very hard, the six of us with fire. Uh, and it turned out there was uh, three machine guns and about 10 insurgents uh, in that one position. Uh, as we uh, approached, uh, we just got bogged down so much by fire that we couldn't uh, continue to move forward. So we, we crawled forward until there was uh, essentially an opportunity um, where the other guys, they just couldn't move. So I just saw an opportunity. I was able to, uh, to luckily move forward to the, uh, to the position and, uh, and neutralise the, uh, the remaining two machine guns. And then, uh, and then when the other lads came up, um, we cracked on and, and uh, mopped up the rest of the position. It's obviously a great privilege um, and it is very humbling because you know I'm a, I'm a soldier and I was part of a team so uh, yeah I think uh, the most important thing for me to take away from it is that uh, you know I'm here representing everyone else back home but you know the whole ADF and more importantly my uh, my team who are with me on the day. I think we've learned those lessons uh, the hard way in the past, but nowadays I think people understand that you can't uh, you can't take it on the soldiers. You know they're doing their job, um, they're doing what is right, uh, and they all want to come home to their families just like everyone else is. So uh, I think it's extremely important that we continue to support them in all uh, in all facets.